But what happens if you have a thousand cars? That's a you know we can probably have you know a thousand cars or more um, in the Bay Area uh, by the end of this year. Probably I don't know five hundred or more in the Greater Boston, the Greater Boston area. That is huge breaking news made by Elon Musk at the All In podcast today. He announced that they would have over 1,000, likely over 1,000 um, robo-taxi cars in the San Francisco Bay Area by the end of this year, and over 500. Combine those two, that'd be over 1,500. Um, you know, could be up to 2,000. And then they would have another 100 or so in six or eight new cities that they would say they'd have like maybe 10 each in by starting them out there with drivers. So this would be about the scale of Waymo, which has about 1,500 vehicles. So they go from about 10% inside the Waymo's fleet to, or, or only 5%, to a full uh, equaling of Waymo at the end of this year, and then go beyond them likely by by um, Q2. Because they, the, if they open up 68 cities, new cities, then they would also go the same path of like having a test driver for up to three months, and then going to a, a thousand some vehicles. Um, by Q2, because they finished Q1, maybe even by March. And then they would then have 10,000 vehicles um, in in Q2, maybe even 20,000. And then on track to go into 200,000 or a million by the end of next year. Safety is improving. And clearly they, they see the data that shows that's improving. Um, there was some NISA reports that they had three accidents in the beginning of the um, of, of the June, July uh, timeframe for the teething pains around Austin, and then one accident in September. So that means the bulk of the miles, 200,000 or so, uh, in Austin um, have, had only one accident. And now so things seem to be going very smoothly. They're making the software, and they're going to the full system. So the breaking news is timeline for RoboTaxi has been revealed, and this should likely uh, do great things to the stock as it happens over the next uh, 60 days. So thanks for listening. Listen, like and subscribe next week's future, and we'll talk to you next time. Thanks.